inclement weather did little to deter committed racegoers for the final day of the big Derby Festival weekend at the Curra. And Foley's antiques were on hand as usual with a fine display of equine art and antiques. The final race of the weekend was sponsored by Foley Antiques and a well-timed surge by Captain Seabee brought a great reaction from the crowd and ensured victory for the J.P. McManus-owned horse. A presentation was made to the representatives of the winning owner, the winning trainer Edward Harty, and the winning jockey Fran Berry by Mr. Derek Carruthers, owner of Foley's Antiques. Well, Alan, it's the big derby weekend at the Curra, and you're once again sponsoring a race. Foley's are becoming something of a fixture at the Curra these days. Yes, that's right, yes. We sponsored a race last September, and we were thrilled with the reception we got from the Curra and the feedback that we got from our customers. So we have a three-race deal with the Curra this season. This is the first race uh, on Derby Sunday, and we will sponsor another race in September and one actually in August as well. So, yeah, three races. That's a fair commitment, but of course Foley's have become known now as the experts in equine art and uh, it's a major part of your business. Yes, it is, and we're delighted to support the people. You see, we feed off an industry and uh, we don't put anything into racing. We don't, uh, you know, pay blacksmiths, we don't buy horse feed or whatever, but we need the industry to do well in order for us to do well. So it's only fair that we give a little bit back. What goes around comes around. Yes, very much so, yeah. And the the artist in in fav, fa, the flavour of the month these days is uh, David Trundley. Yes, David's been selling very well over the last what three or four years, but particularly in the last eighteen months. And we're looking forward to having a collection of David's now, probably from September on, for the run up to Christmas.